what's your over clear, what's the crack? Um, we're out of championship now, so we lost the Sligo at the weekend. Failed a fitness test above there before the match, which was obviously very disappointing. So looking back in the year, I played one championship match out of four. Injured, injured for three, injured coming up to three, but I declared myself fit for two, so but I was still carrying an injury. So um, looking back on the season, that's obviously very disappointing, and I feel like you know I'll have I have a lot to work on and things like that. So uh, off season now, and the night we finished was the Saturday, so we had a match on the Saturday, and I went out on the Saturday night with the boys. And had a couple of drinks, so I think I, in in all I had about f three or four Guinnesses, and I had maybe I don't know five, six shots or something like that. And when I came home that night, I had actually left my um, I realised I left my covers, I dust my covers in Leitrim where we stayed for the match, and I had the worst. My voice is still a little bit funny from it. I had the worst night of sleep ever on Saturday. I don't know. It was obviously a mix of the alcohol and not having the dust mites. I had to dust my covers. So Sunday, which was two days ago, was the worst I've ever been. Well, definitely the worst I've been for the last year. I literally could not do anything. I could not function. And um, yeah, I really struggled big time all day. I just had this like pressure on the front of my face. I constantly was sniffling and sneezing. Um, I had aches in my elbows, um, aches in my arms and aches in my legs. That was very unusual. I never had that before. So I had aches in, uh, in all my limbs kind of different times during the day. they come on and they go. And then on Sunday night, my sleep was, I still had a terrible sleep. Now what I did have, I had one pillowcase cover. So I had one dust mat cover, but I didn't have a duvet cover or um, a uh, mattress cover. So I had one pillowcase cover. And the Sunday night, I actually got up at about five o'clock in the morning and I left my room and I went down and I sat on the couch downstairs. And I actually sat on the couch again last night and I felt it was a little bit better if, if you're sleeping on, on um, leather couches, for example, don't tend to uh, hold as much dust as uh, a bed or a mattress. So I'm still kind of, my chest is really tight today. I can feel that. Um, I, I know now if I went out exercising and I didn't take inhalers, I would literally be dying. So uh, my breathing is quite tight today. So yeah, definitely feeling the effects of not having the covers. Fortunately, um, the hotel sent down the sent down the covers today, so they came in the post. So a nice, good night's sleep tonight, which will be great. Uh, the plan for the next couple of weeks is I'm obviously in the off season. Over the next couple of videos, I'm going to go through what my diet's going to look like and what my training regime is going to look like. And um, I've also been in contact with a couple of people. I'm looking forward to going into a clinic in town for maybe some salt therapy to see if that helps me. And I'll kind of give a little bit of a run through on that. And I'm also looking for a place in Limerick where people can get allergy tests done at a reasonable price. So that you know, people have been contacting me about getting allergy tests done. Where can they get them done? Where to get mine done? And I want to be able to recommend somewhere. So I want to try somewhere out, see if it's any good, uh, do a, bit of, a couple of videos on it, give my opinion on it, and then people can take it from there. And hopefully maybe get some discounts actually for people too. That'd be great. So that's how it's been. A rough couple of days for me. Voice and chest is definitely feeling it. Um, I've been very tired the last few days, just really poor sleep. Um, we had a great night out, so uh, that was a good crack. And um, yeah, so I'll talk to you soon.